Hey guys, how's it going? I am making a tutorial on how to install the Mo Creatures mod. This tutorial was su submitted and requested. I don't know why I said submitted, but anyways, by Sai, and you shall get your reward. Oh yeah. Mm. Anyways, go to the link I will provide in the description. The only things you need in here will be provided. So what you need to do is download this, take you to an ad fly link, don't worry. Just wait for this to say, please wait, five, four, three, two, one. Skip ad. There may be a window pop up, just close it. Don't click on the ads. Oh, it didn't pop up, okay. Just leave it down there. Anyways, you need to install Forge Client, just click on it. Okay, maybe it wants to take me here for some odd reason. Never done that before. Maybe it wants to be cool like the other people. There you go. Let me just go back down. Need to install a GUI API. Let that load. I'm uploading a video, so it's kind of slow. And then custom well spawner. So you should have four things installed. Minecraft Forge, uh, Mo Creature Mod, GUI API, and Custom Mob Spawner. I think I just said it twice, but whatever. Download these four things. There it goes. That Mo Creatures Mod is going to take a while to install. So, I'm going to let that finish installing. I'll be right back. Okay, so those are now downloaded. Now I'll click on the Windows key. Go to downloads. See, I have those four things downloaded. Go to my desktop. Drag those four items to your desktop. You just messed up on their own. Thank you, Windows. All right, close all your downloads. You don't need it anymore. Uh, where did my folder go? Uh, I'll find it later. Anyways, uh, go to your Windows. Type in percent app data percent. Go to your roaming. Got Minecraft bin. You guys have done this. Right click on Minecraft. Open with WinRAR. If you don't have WinRAR, Google it. Get the trial. That's what I have. Just minimize your bin folder. Uh, next, what you want to do is delete meta in folder. But I'm not going to delete this one because I already have my. Uh, mod installed and one of these folders has made it inf don't worry about it just delete if you ha don't have your mods installed delete made it inf first and then wow thank you windows and then they will have a made it inf folder don't worry about it it's not going to crash anything it's me meant to be there so open your forge see that's where made it inf is what you want to do is Select all the folders, or you can press Control A if you're faster than me, and then just drag all these folders into here. I already did this. Go to your GUI API, do the exact same. Go away. Go to the exact same thing. Just call it. Just hide everything. Drag it in there. Call it good. Now you're done with this, and. Now you should run Minecraft. What's going to happen when you run Minecraft is the FML folder file, whatever. It's going to run its course. Just let it do it. Login, login. There you go. Setting up for Minecraft. There should be no crashes if we did this, what I did. If we did it correctly. There you go, mods loaded. So go ahead and quit out of your Minecraft. I don't know why that's glitching. Maybe it's because my fraps is open. Yeah, I have your fraps. Okay. Oh, there we go. I hit it. Okay. So go back to your bin folder. Back out. Now you should see a ton of new folders and files in here. Leave them alone. Now see this folder called mods. Open it. What you want to do is take your custom mob spawner, these sharks, and drag these two into this mods folder. And that should work. Very simple. It's 
It's a little bit confusing at first, don't worry, it's quite simple. So, let me run and let me show you a little bit of the uh, Mo Creatures mod. I know that when people do their tutorials on Mo Creatures mod, they show you what Mo Creatures mod is first, then get on the tutorial. I'm not like that. I want to show you the tutorial first, then show you what uh, Mo Creatures mod looks like. Let me start a new world. Cool, sure, create new world. Building terrain. Do 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 do. There we go. There's a sheep flying on the. Oh, there's a sheep on the tree. We go to game mode. One. There are a ton of mobs. There are a ton of things you can do with Mo Creatures mod. It's loading. Oh, I have it on peaceful. Let me turn easy. Now we go find someone. There's a village. Where is the mob? Surprised I'm not spawning here. There's a bunch of chickens right there. Hard to me, chickens. Uh, lava. There's, there we go. There's a mob. This is the fox. Uh, he's pretty cool. You can punch him. You can punch him again. And you can punch him again. We call it good. There's tons and tons of mobs. You can get uh, fish eggs, and he's trying to follow me, trying to attack me. If you want to uh, customize spawns, what you want to do is press Escape, Options, Global Mod Options, Mo Creatures, Spawn Limits. You can mess with this. You can set it higher by clicking this blue square over here. I usually just keep it at 50, call it good. Mess with that. You can go to Hunter Creatures. Mess with all these different options. Uh, you can go to animals. You know, you can set, uh, get rid of the kittens, get rid of deers, add more deers. You see, I put my turtles to 10, so I get more turtles to spawn. And you can reset it to default also. I have not messed with this yet. Number to spawn, creature. Uh, sure. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, that scared me a little. I'm sorry. Oh, I just lagged and it was like, oh, there's a bear. Well, that's pretty cool. I didn't know you could spawn animals, but yeah, there's a ton of things you can do with this. You can mess with the bears. You can punch them. Punch them, punch them, punch them. And yeah, go have fun with this mod. It's pretty awesome. I use it for my Let's Play. I also use Timber Mod. Let me save out. If you're wondering how to install Timber Mod, it's just like uh, Forge and GUI API where you copy the files, drag them into your Minecraft jar, and call it good. You don't have to do anything else. So, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. I will answer them as fast as I can. And I will see you guys later. Bye! <laughs> Thank you.